We're also getting reaction to a major merger between two well-known Catholic high schools. Archbishop Curley Notre Dame High School will consolidate with Monsignor Edward Pace High School for the upcoming school year. Local 10's Carlos Suarez explains what is, what's behind the merger and how students and alumni are reacting. After 63 years, Archbishop Curley Notre Dame High School in Miami will begin a new chapter at another beloved Catholic school. The Archdiocese of Miami announced Monday the school is merging with Monsignor Pace High come fall of 2017. Definitely it's a necessary but a difficult decision. The Archdiocese said the decision wasn't an easy one. Enrollment at the school has been down for several years and the campus is in need of upgrades and repairs. Only 229 students attend the school this year that's down 43 students from 2015. When you have an enrollment of 229, it's just no longer feasible. It's a, a, a very good school and it gave her a chance to get a little broader education than the I think about 100 kids they have now. Current students in good standing will have no trouble getting into Monsignor Pace next year as well as getting to school. The Archdiocese said it's providing bus transportation to the campus in Miami Gardens. Most of them are worried about how far Pace is and most of them are worried that like at Pace everything will be different. Pace High has a sizably larger number of students at 836. The Archdiocese said portables will most likely be brought in to accommodate the new students and staff. There's so much rich history here. Yes. What's it like to have to turn that page? One of the great things about memories is that you can take them with you. The changes go into effect next fall. The Archdiocese says it plans to work with teachers to place them elsewhere within the Catholic school district and that no decision has been made about the old campus. Reporting in Miami Gardens, I'm Carlos Suarez, Local 10 News.